Hey guys, Ricardo here. Welcome to another Blog Tech Tips. And of course, today guys, I'd like to share a tip with you on how to fix an issue I encountered with a friend's device. Now, of course, I'll show you the screenshot I actually took or a picture I actually took showing the display and what the error looks like. Now, this error appeared on a friend of mine's um, phone. And as you can see here, it says error retrieving information from server RH-01. And it gives you the option to retry. Even if you retry, it will not um it will not go away now of course this is a google play store error and i'm going to show you the steps i actually use to fix the problem on my own personal device now i did not get to record this video but of course the procedure will be the same since my device is also an android device so if you're um, encountering this issue please try these tips now of course here's my device and i'm going to show you exactly what to do now the first thing i do guys is go to settings and under settings you can go ahead and search but what we're going to search for is accounts and that is all the link accounts to your samsung galaxy or android device as long as it's running android that should be fine but i already know where the option is so i'm going to, so I'm going to go down to general management and under general management you see a bunch of options but of course way down here it says and let me just show you Way down here it says look for something else and it does say accounts so if you tap on accounts down here it should go to your accounts associated and of course you'll see your gmail accounts um, you should see only one but if you have two accounts associated you should see two so what i'm going to do is just go ahead and tap on one option once you tap you'll have the option to remove on other devices or older devices you might see a three dots in the upper um, right where you have to tap and actually click on remove now once you remove your account it will then be entirely um, replaced on your device and of course what i'll require that you do is just go back to google play store once you launch google play store to ask for your google account use your original google account and sign back in or try another account that you may have by doing that in most cases it should fix the problem and you will not have the error anymore once you try to log into your um, or use Google your Google account with the um, Play Store. That's the first tip. Now the second tip, guys, is you're gonna go to settings. Once in settings, go over to apps or applications. So once you find the application or application manager, and you go into all apps as you're seeing here, all apps we're on, guys. Uh, now from here the easiest way to fix the problem is to actually tap on the three dots here and of course you're gonna reset app preferences and by doing this it should overall fix the problem but of course guys if you want this extra step you can go ahead and find also the Google Play Store and once you find the Google Play Store just go ahead and go to storage and once in storage, just go ahead and clear cache, clear data, and of course go back and force stop the app. You can also reboot the phone. And that of course is the second tip and should help to fix the issue or the problem. Another thing to do guys is to go to settings. And while you're in settings, again, you go down to general management. And under general management, just look for date and time. And of course, here you can see a bunch of um, settings. And of course, you can manually set the time and set the date. Make sure that they're actually up to date, especially for the time. You can have server issues if the wrong time is set, as this is what the device uses to sync the phone and use apps use it and so on. And of course, if it's wrong, it can cause potential or some weird issues on your device. So that might be the problem that you're having. And of course, guys, if all of that fails, especially removing your Google account, re-adding it, trying a totally new Google account and all of that, guys. Um, the last and final step is to back up your device. Then you're going to go to settings. And of course, again, you're going to go down to um, general management. And of course, tap on reset. Another reset, guys. Let's go ahead and hit factory data reset. And of course, when you do a factory data reset, please be advised that this will, and this is the option that I'm showing you here, will erase all data on your device totally. 
so be warned before attempting this but of course that's a final resort and only if everything else has failed of course guys i'm sure one of those um, will work for you in getting your device to work again of course my friend's device is working just fine and of course that was after using the first tip and i'm sure for most of you to work for that one others it might be other tips so please go ahead in the comments and share which specific tip actually worked for you in fixing this specific problem and of course guys ricardo from block tech tips saying bye until next time guys bye